Hello everyone, my name is Willie Kasakula. I'm a master's student at the African Center of Excellence in Internet of Things. That's in Rwanda. Um, one of my courses requires me to do a project, take a video of it, and present it to you on YouTube. So I hope you find this useful. I'm going to put a description uh, below of how you can set it up and a GitHub link for the code that you're going to have it for free. Uh, you can use it in any of your projects. So, uh, just to describe what the project is, basically, uh, you can be leaving your home, okay, you leave no one behind, and an intruder can get in. So, for security purposes, you might want a, a system that will detect any time an intruder is in your home, it notices you, so you can take any specific measures. So, this system does uh, specifically that. Its scope is to just detect the, uh, an intruder who is in your home and notifies you from wherever you are in the world. So how it works is, uh, there is a node MCU, this is a microcontroller, which is like the brain of the system that will be installed in your home. Uh, this node MCU has a Wi-Fi chip, which it, it's gonna use to connect to the internet, basically. Uh, and it also has connected uh, a PIR sensor, that's passive infrared sensor. So, if anything that has heat, specifically a human heat at 37 degrees Celsius or somewhere around there, it emits infrared, um, it emits infrared. So, the passive infrared sensor is going to detect that infrared and if the human is in motion, it's going to detect that, okay, there is motion here and uh, it will take that data to the node MCU and the node MCU is going to upload it to the Blink cloud, the Blink server, using the internet with Wi-Fi, of course. So, with you, from wherever you are in the world, as long as you have internet and a Blink app installed, which I'm going to tell you how to set it up, um, you're going to receive that message. So, the system in your home sends a message to the Blink Cloud, and the Blink Cloud sends it to your mobile phone, and you're going to say that an intruder is detected in my home, and you can take some measures with it. I don't know what you can do, depends. So uh, here I'm going to show you how that system works. Thank you. Now, here's the setup of my system. This right here, this is the Node MCU, it's the microcontroller, and as you can see, uh, I've connected it to this thing, and this is the PIR sensor. Basically, it's the one that detects uh, human motion using infrared. There's a lot of physics connected to that. I, uh, I advise you to read about it. And this USB cable is just for powering the node MCU. Now, I've connected it to my laptop, yes, but it could have been any power source, like any phone charger. Uh, now, this node MCU has a Wi-Fi chip and has to be connected to a Wi-Fi access point that has internet connection. For now, I've just used a, a hotspot from a mobile phone. It could have been any other mobile phone. Now, on this smartphone, I also ha uh, have installed a Blink app. So, the, the basic working principle is the Node MCU is going to send data to the Blink app using the internet connection, and this mobile app is going to uh, take that data from the Blink server to display it here. Now I just have configured, this is an LCD, a virtual LCD uh, in the Blink app. In the description I also have it how to, to configure. I've written it in my GitHub, I'll put the link. So uh, to demonstrate to you, I'm going to uh, press the play button to start the app. So right now the app uh, is working. This mobile phone, imagine that it's in the USA and the system is installed in your home in Malawi. So. That PIR sensor could be in your room. And someone just enters the room. So notice how I put my hand here. And notice how it read an intruder detected. You see? So uh, I should do that again. If I put my hand this side, it writes intruder detected. OK, let me do it again. Put my hand. It writes intruder detected here. So. If anyone enters your room where you have set the system up, okay, 
uh, you're going to get a notification that intruder is detected from your mobile app. So you can do a lot of things with it. You can configure it to, to send an email, uh, or you can have it notify anyone else. You can have it uh, to, to like set an alarm that will notify the neighbors and whoever. So uh, this is just how Internet of Things works. Thank you.